Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your daily reading for oh Thursday, April 26. The timing is fluid, so even though this is the message I'm getting today, it doesn't mean that it is just for today. This is the message I'm getting for today. This is for all signs. I have pre-shuffled this, so I'm just going to go ahead and whatever falls out, I'm going to lay out. Somebody is rele releasing a toxic situation, you know, they're, they're letting go of something that is toxic. It, it, it was too burdensome. It was too heavy. I don't need to be a part of this anymore. I don't. So it feels like somebody is following their intuition and they're having enough compassion for themselves to let go of something that was toxic. I've decided to make a conscious change. because I love myself enough, I have compassion for myself, and I'm ready for some tranquility in my life. I think I'm going to sit back and be patient. There's no hurry for me. Somebody is, is, is slowing down. They are. Somebody is absolutely slowing down. Bringing balance and harmony to their lives. Yeah, patience. I've just this is patience. I have decided that, you know, I I don't need to be involved in this anymore. I don't want to be involved with this right now. It's all about me, and I need to work on me. I need to work on my own self love. It's a time of healing. Somebody has decided that the time is now to heal. So they had to let something go, and that's exactly what they're doing. This is the death card. So with endings bring new beginnings, but we have to wait for things to grow. So it feels like there is absolutely a release here, a much needed release. Somebody has been involved in a situation that brought them a lot of drama, um, a lot of discord. Uh, could have been some some serious manipulation involved in whatever you were involved with. And somebody has decided that I am not going to be a part of this anymore. It's time for me to make this change so that I can bring back the harmony, the peace, the contentment, the happiness, the tranquility that I so much crave to my life. Somebody is going through a transformation as well. They've changed. I'm not the same person I used to be. And in order for me to move forward in my new beginning, I have to be emotionally available. And so for me to be emotionally available, I have to slow down and I have to be patient with myself. I have to allow myself to heal. I have to allow myself to master my emotions and in order to do that you all sometimes you have to release something that is burdensome and heavy and somebody has done that and it's a huge relief I see the relief here now someone um, is about to fulfill a new dream okay this is a dreamer and I feel like somebody has a new dream my dreams have changed I have a new dream here there's a new beginning there's a new beginning here but somebody is in no rush no rush at all to jump into anything because I have just let go of something that was harmful and burdensome.
Yeah, somebody is, is standing up for themselves. Because they were in a situation where they couldn't be in their own power. They couldn't, it wasn't... truthful okay it wasn't where they wanted to be there was dishonesty in this situation and now someone has decided to fight for themselves fight for myself I'm gonna fight for myself here it's all about me right now I need to take care of myself I feel like somebody has given up on a situation that Was it secure? It wasn't stable. It was manipulative and controlling and smothering. Something was holding you back. And it wasn't authentic. So it feels like somebody has come to this conclusion that it's time for me to restore control in my life and drop this burden and get back to me, start the healing process. I'm not the same person I used to be. This has changed me. I can't be here anymore. I'm gonna work on myself. I'm gonna slow down. I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna find myself again. And I'm going to reopen my heart. Somebody is going through a rebirth. And they're making it happen. They're making it happen because they see that they were involved in a toxic situation. And they've made the... They've made the decision to stand up for themselves. There's been too much bullshit. I can't do it anymore. It's over. My dreams are bigger than this. Yeah. Somebody is taking a time out to refocus, to replan. Right now, it's a time of reflection. So I think many of you that are watching this are probably going deep within to figure out what your future holds. To become conscious of what you want and who you are. So what I see is that someone has decided to Turn their back on something, let it end, go within, start the healing process, and refocus on you. And to be patient. Patience is here all over. I'm going to slow down and be patient and wait for my ships to come in. I'm going to prepare myself during this time for the right situation. I'm going to work on me right now alone, alone, and get myself ready. For the real deal. So I feel like today is a day of coming to grips with the changes that are happening within you. You're not the same person anymore. You've evolved. You've been in a situation that was less than happy, okay? It was burdensome. It was troublesome. It was karmic, 
Okay, it was. Somebody was in a negative situation. They've come to the conclusion that I can't be involved in this anymore. So I'm going to drop this. I'm going to walk away. I'm going to let it end with the death card. And with the death and the devil, there's release here. I'm releasing. I'm making this conscious change because I matter. And I'm going to fight for what I want. I'm going to stand up for myself. I'm going to figure out what I want. And I'm going to wait for it to come. So I feel like today is a day of, or yesterday, or you know how this is. This, this could be going on, you know, at any time. Somebody is re-evaluating who they are. And what they want. Where they're going. And being patient with the divine plan. So I feel like today is about making changes and allowing divine timing to play out. There's no rush, there's no hurry. When the time is right, it will come. During this time, I am going to prepare myself for the real deal. Whether this is work or love or whatever, it's a time of preparation, stepping back, refocusing, figuring out who you are, what you want, and where you're going. And that's what I have.